Now we got a lander. What's up, guys? Eric, I'm gonna do something a little bit different today. I've got the uh, V4 Typhon. I've kind of got the itch to uh, do some vertical launches and uh, see if I can break a record, a personal record, or maybe even a world record. Who knows? Uh, uh, first of all, big shout out to uh, Hardcore RC and Kevin Talbot. I know they've been uh, sending their rigs up there pretty high, up in the 50 something foot range. So I'm gonna uh, give it my go. Uh, so far, I've got uh, 75 feet high with it on a prior bash with, with uh, my buddy, and I got 62 feet with the uh, Arm Italian EXB. Coming up too, I'm gonna to be going for another distance jump. Uh, so far I've got 200 feet with this buggy, uh, but right now I'm just gonna be going for some vertical height just for something fun, something different. And my truck's lowering itself. <laughs> but anyway, that's that's gonna be another whole uh, video, another whole ramp build, because um, that ramp right there is more of a uh, vertical uh, up and out, uh, not you know not too much of a straight distance jump. So we'll be uh, messing with that in the future. I'm gonna be using the Sky RC Performance Analyzer. Some guys were saying that it's not uh, accurate, but guys, you got, this thing is actually very accurate. You just have to uh, you have to have enough air time. You can't just go up and straight back down. You gotta have enough time for it to read because it does it because it is based on air pressure, and you do have to have a nice clear day because if you have a lot of rain and stuff like that, it's gonna mess up the air pressure as well. So I've tested this thing many times, and it's uh it, it's pretty accurate. I can actually stand up uh, here. We'll test it right now, real quick, just to kind of get an idea. Get to my phone here. flying mode we'll start off on the ground let's hit start and I'm about uh, five eight in height I'm gonna raise this all the way above my head as, as tall as I can go it should be around seven feet or so and then we'll bring it back down stop read see it's reading seven feet you probably can't see that so that's pretty accurate I'd say but anyway all right guys we're just gonna give this a quick run see what's up all right, guys, we're going to give her a go. Um, we're running Hoons on it. Uh, I've got a 27-tooth pinion on stock electronics. Uh, again, she's all M2 cfi uh, chassis uh, blocks, uh, towers, everything. So she's uh, definitely beefcake and ready to send. It's a pretty good launch. <laughs> now we got to go get it. And we'll bring it back and see what she did. Stop. Read. All right, guys. That first jump was. All right, that was 66 feet. If you can see it, at 75 miles an hour. So we're gonna go again. See if we can get any better. <laughs> guys, this is like this is like doing a speed run and uh and launch at the same time. It's pretty cool. All right, guys, on that last jump, we got 79 feet at 79 miles an hour. That's a 79 feet high, max speed 79 miles an hour. Now we got a lander. <laughs> I say she was up there. Luckily, she's still plugged in so I can listen to the motor and find out where she's at in this brush out here. <laughs> Got to go hiking for it. There she is. Still in one piece. Are my M2C tough? All right, stop. Read. All right, guys, 82 feet that time at 83 miles an hour. I put a fresh pack in it, a brand new battery. So she had uh, lots of punch on that one. So that's another record. 82 feet high at 83 miles an hour uh, hitting the ramp. <laughs> that's crazy. Pretty excited about that. All right, guys, I'm going to give it one more go to uh, kind of compare notes with that 82 footer. I had to put some Gorilla Tape around the body because the body's kind of shot. Uh, and once you get up over 80 miles an hour, it starts to get a lot of, a lot of air up under the body. So this buggy's not set up uh, for speed runs, really. So we're going to uh, see what we can do this time. All right, get her up here and turned around. It's kind of like speed run launching. <laughs> I got a little bit of a headwind coming in too right here, so. <laughs> and 
and she bounced on that one let's go get her all right guys on that reading we got 79 feet max height again that's height not distance and a max speed of 81 miles an hour so it's pretty consistent with what i've been getting uh with the 80 with the 82 foot 83 miles an hour on the previous run i just wanted to kind of compare it just to kind of see where uh where it was um uh, compared to the other runs so i'd say it's uh, fairly consistent guys Couldn't tell if it was upside down or what. Hit the dirt. <laughs> All right, guys, I had the Sky RC GPS in there to get the uh, vertical height and the speed on that uh, last ramp launch. We got 75 feet and a uh, maximum height and at 76 miles an hour. Nice. Oh. <laughs> yeah, and then bounced, bounced over the edge. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. This little, yeah. This, yeah. This, this retaining wall is tricky. Yeah. I thought that thing was what. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she's up there. It's a lot of fun. My neighbor has those things. Now. Really? It's crazy how expensive they are, too. Yeah, it adds up, but it's it's, it's almost worth it. Did you record that? Yeah. Ah. Yeah, I got a GoPro I'll keep on my head, so. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. Appreciate it, buddy. Appreciate it. Carnage. Oh, I heard <laughs> nice, bro. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't dirt. <laughs> Nice. The crusher. 